The following is a paid program brought to you by Trivita. Do you suffer from chronic inflammation? If so, do you know what's causing it? Or even more important, how you can manage it? On today's program, medical doctor Scott Connard explains the root causes of inflammation, its pain points, and how to reduce inflammation without negative side effects naturally. You will also hear from Michael R. Ellison, Trivita founder, author, and wellness thought leader, share why he thinks a natural anti-inflammatory product could be a gift from God to mankind. Now, here's your hosts, James and Betty Robinson. Oh boy, am I glad to be talking to you. I'm James Robinson. This is my wife, Betty. Now think about this. I mean, we're both 76 years old. She really doesn't like me saying that. She said, tell them how old you are. I speak, well, we're going to be soon married, soon married 57 years. And you know what? We're loving life. I never dreamed that I would be looking at you and being able to tell you about something that I think could be one of the greatest bits of information and good news you ever got in your life. Now, I've I've experienced something as a very active person. I I love to fish. I love to play golf. I developed, Betty, and I know sometimes I played too much, okay? That probably contributed (laughs) to my problem. You know, you're you're very (laughs) grace-filled. Everybody that knows you knows that. And they also know this about us. When we find something that helps people, let me, let me tell you something about me as, as just an individual. When I experience something exciting or fun, I don't keep it a secret. If I experience something good, I can't wait to share it. And I want to share the best I find with everybody. I'll tell you why. It may be hard to believe. I really care about you. I, I have a, a God who said he's our father and he said, love him with all your heart. But then he said, love your neighbors yourself. And you know what he let me in on one time not too long ago? He said, James, you've actually reached the place. I believe you love your neighbor more than yourself. I think that's possible because it's amazing. When I experience something great, I can't wait to share it. Now listen, I said I'm active. I like to play golf, I like to fish. That means a lot of activity, but something really rough started happening to me. My mother had crippling rheumatoid arthritis, my birth mother. I noticed that I got a very difficult time moving my arm. I developed what was called tennis elbow, or for me, golfer's elbow. I reached a point where I couldn't stand to take a divot. The pain was so great for me to do anything strenuous, I had to put a tight strap around my arm. I hurt so bad. And then a miracle happened in my life. A friend of mine found a product that he said God pointed him to, and God said he gives us plants for our healing and our benefit. And much of the medical advance has come from plants. He found something in the Sonoran Desert that offered what was known to be, and tests seemed to reveal that it was an inflammation fighter. I had this elbow and the experience of pain for 30 years. I had it injected so many times with cortisone, and I'd get a little relief sometimes for a few weeks, and then it's back even worse. I said, we can't afford to do it anymore. And then I met a wonderful doctor, and he's sitting here. And Dr. Conard said, I want to help you add years to your life and life to your years. And I met a medical doctor (laughs) that didn't just care about me. You love people. So you gave me some advice. And I I want to touch on that in a minute because, listen, what, what I was led to, but it started with him, led to a product called Nopalea, which is the cactus plant in the Sonoran Desert, my friend found, his name is Michael Ellison. He's sitting right here. Now you're gonna know a little bit more about him in a moment, but he's, he's sitting right here as a, a 35 year friend. And you saw the journey. Betty, you watched me in serious pain. What did you see? Because I'm about to tell you, I, I didn't just get better. I am 10 years pain free. I can't say that can happen for everybody, but it's happened for thousands of people. And here's the miracle, Betty. <laughs> Look at this, this is from Harvard Medical. They've just pointed out that inflammation is perhaps one of the greatest, if not the greatest contributor to major diseases and certainly to pain. When you saw what happened to me, was it pretty impressive and exciting? Very impressive, and I know you. You do like to stay active. You do enjoy the outdoors. And so when I saw you struggling with the pain in your on your arm, trying to just do anything, wearing the brace sometimes, just to take, take the pressure off of it, and then you started taking the Nopalea, I, I was amazed. It, I, you, can't, you can't make people promises about something, but it happened so fast for me that I really wasn't better I was well, 
and been that way for 10 years. But Michael said, I'm, I'm the most dedicated to being faithful to taking every good supplement. And Dr. Conard, you're the reason you got me faithfully trying to contribute to my own future and health. So what do you think about what we're talking about that helped me so much? And with what Harvard says, it looks like a lot of people have trouble with inflammation. Or is inflammation and pain and the problems that Harvard talks about contributing to disease in our body, is that a reality and something everybody needs to know? Absolutely. We know that inflammation is, well, all of us know what inflammation is. It's swelling, redness, pain, and heat. So whether it's a mosquito bite or you get a cut or you sprain an ankle, we know that you get acute or sudden inflammation and it's associated often with some pain to let your body, you know, say, ouch, there's a problem here. You got to do something about it. And so, so we all understand that. But the revolutionary scientific advances that we have is now we understand that that same process that can be very pronounced with the things we just talked about can also occur chronically or over a long time. And as it occurs, it actually contributes to chronic disease, to death, to disability, to getting sicker and sicker. And so James, with your, with your, with your golfer's elbow that you had, and we tried lots of different things and you were getting oh, yeah. injections, that would fix it for a couple minutes and then the chronic nature of it would come back and fix it and the chronic nature would come back. And we're actually understanding now that when you have it in one part of your body, often that affects other parts of your body, your immune system, which is the part of our body that, that, that regulates or manages inflammation, gets turned up and now we start having many things go wrong with the body, even inside the blood vessels and other things. We'll talk about that later. But with muscles and joints, I've seen it just hundreds of times in my practice. What will happen is someone will get a joint like like your arm or like a neck or a shoulder back and then it'll start to get inflamed. It'll start to get sore. Then they'll do less. And then their cholesterol, blood pressure, their weight will go up and then they'll do less because it's harder and they're in pain. And so there's a cycle that gets established where people who, like yourself, could be very, very vital. If we start to yield to that and we start to, to slow down, to do less. And I know, Betty, you've been great about making sure he doesn't slow down and he always <laughs> takes responsibility and it's worked over the years. And, and so we were in a place with you and your care and I as your doctor, where it was very frustrating because we were putting band-aids on it, but your inflammation in your body was high. And we, so we needed to... Thank you for watching. I'm interrupting this program with this special message during this national health crisis. First, please know that you are God's special person. He loves and cares for you. You were created to be his temple here on earth, to radiate his life and his love. It is also important to recognize that God has designed your body with systems and organs to help keep you well. Supporting your body systems is in your control and your lifestyle choices will make a huge difference in your health and well-being. You can energize your immune system by eating more fruits and vegetables, adding vitamin C and D, hydrating your body with purified water. Research proves sleep enhances the immune defense and managing your stress with positive thoughts, not fear-based thoughts. As the scriptures remind us, God has not given us the spirit of fear, but of love and power and a sound mind. Be wise, be prudent, and be strong. Please ask for my book, The 10 Habits of Wellness, which I'm giving away free during this health crisis to help you live with greater health and well-being. I believe that there is a gift from God that He has given to us in many of the plants for our health. And uh, it wasn't in a lab. It wasn't working with the scientist and doing the things that you might think you're trying to do when you're coming up with a new formula. But I was actually in Mexico and I was with the Siri people. They are uh, a tribe in northern Mexico. They've been known as a fierce warrior tribe for hundreds of years, very strong, very athletic. And I was sitting there in an evening around a campfire and there was nine of us. I had a translator and they began to talk about the people, the ancient people, being to talk about the plants in the Sonoran Desert. 
there was such a awe and such a revere that came around that campfire. It was like, God, there has to be one of your plants in the Sonoran Desert that you talked about as a green plant I give you. Well, I went back to Arizona, contacted the University of Arizona, and what they came up with is all of the different kinds of plants in the Sonoran Desert. And I said, there's got to be one that would be prolific that we would be able to take and uh, be able to manufacture and give to thousands of people. It led us to that particular plant, which is the nopal cactus. Well, here's another reason why. After we manufactured it, Susan, she had her health challenges, and Betty, you know her well. Okay, Susan was no longer able to be on the treadmill, no longer able to jog, no longer able to walk and it, without a cane. We were in Telluride, Colorado, and a beautiful place in the mountains. And she said to me, Michael, I think that I may be on a cane for the rest of my life. What do you think about that? We have a wellness company. And I said to her, you know, I don't know to what extent the anti-inflammatory benefits are of this product, but we just got this product. Let's try it. She went on three to six ounces a day, and I watched the redness go out of her feet. I watched the swelling go out of her feet. I saw her put on her jogging shoes again, and she has been doing it five days a week for years now, living an amazing quality of life. Do I think it's a big gift from God? If it was just for her, it was a gift from God. Yeah, and i tell you what, I feel that way. I, 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 I'm just got to say something. Harvard Medical School, you know, I'm, 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 you might say, rather conservative, okay? I, I really wouldn't have expected Harvard to come out with something so filled with transforming truth that I believe is the love of the God who really wants the best for all of us. And Harvard, boy, did you deliver something great. And I had experienced it without being able to explain it. Dr. Conard, it looks like Harvard has revealed more than just the fact it can relieve a joint like mine, which I, I consider a miracle. It looks like they have shown us a whole lot about inflammation. So if it's helping here, could it be helping? Well, they, they've talked about it causing problems in your circulation and even for your heart, cardiovascular. Isn't that what they're basically saying in this test that they literally have revealed in their scientific research and, and it's here for you, prepared by them? Doesn't it look like they've offered us a tremendous blessing right now? We know, I really appreciate that a lot of the innovative ideas come from the great institutions, the, the Mayos, the Cleveland Clinics, the Harvards. And Harvard has been on this path now for a decade where they were looking at blood pressure and cholesterol and, and diabetes, and they were looking at people who were having heart attacks and strokes, and it, it wasn't following that people with high cholesterol had more heart attacks. People with low cholesterol had less heart attacks. In fact, there was a moment when we got very confused because there was, when people had heart attacks, half of them had high cholesterol and half had, had low cholesterol. And it was like, wait a minute, that doesn't feel correct. So what happened was with, at Harvard with the research, they said, well, something else is obviously going on here. And they did a lot of very innovative research on blood vessels and how blood vessels work. And in that research, they discovered that some people with high cholesterol, that cholesterol causes this low-grade chronic inflammation inside the blood vessel. And those are the people who have the heart attacks and strokes. And other people, they may have weight problems and joint problems and things, but it doesn't seem to burrow, if you will, into the wall and cause that inflammation. So that said, there's a test called a high sensitivity C-reactive protein. There's a doctor actually from Harvard who uh, discovered it, tested it, figured out how it works and they started doing research. Now, I've been the principal investigator in 63 clinical trials. I, I mean, I also feel very spirit-led and very inspired. And as a doctor, I feel like it's my responsibility to make sure that I'm talking about evidence-based medicine. And, and I, you know, I can share people's yes. experiences, but I really want to be able to say there's science behind it. And, and Michael, I have to say to you, one of the reasons that I'm here today and that I am more than happy to come be on a, an educational program with you is that you've spent the time, energy, effort, and money to not just listen to testimonials, that's where it starts, but then to, to spend the money to go do the studies. And I think it's important, James, both with the inflammation we talked about with your elbow and your joints, they did a very important study that showed with the 
with our joints over time, when you take Nopalea, there's a, it was a randomized placebo control, double-blinded study, very, very rigorous, the kind of study that, that Harvard does all the time. And they discovered that when people took Nopalea, people who were getting pain from and related to the inflammation in their neck and shoulder and back, that pain went down, the inflammation went down, they were able to do more. Now, you know, people get in these cycles we talked about earlier where they do less and less and less and then they get sick and they don't operate as well. Well, this was actually opening people back up like a flower and they were starting to do more and be more active. And the study showed that there was statistically significant improvement, particularly in the neck and, and the upper back, on those changes. The other study that Michael and Trivita paid for was a randomized, double-blind, placebo-controlled trial to look at the inflammation that Harvard go, has found is inside the blood vessel that we test with this high sensitivity C-reactive protein. And that test showed the people who with high cholesterol were gonna have a stroke and heart attack, and even with low cholesterol were at higher risk of stroke and heart attack. And we disco they discovered, not me, they discovered that this is an important test it tells us there's chronic inflammation inside the body. The immune system is, is going a little bit awry because of the cholesterol and things. And if you treat it and address it, it can make a huge difference in helping people stave off and not have the heart attack and stroke. Again, Michael, you said that Harvard is actually offering this. They want to go online. What, what do they sell this study for? If you want to actually see uh, what they produce? Yeah, if you will go online, you can buy it for $18. 18, or we'll send it to you. Or we'll send it to you, yeah, yes. And, and, and I'd like to say something else, James, in regard to the National Institute of Health, because Dr. Conrad has been referring to the institutions. One thing that's really important, and I know we've been talking about disease issues, we, we're, not, we're not curing, we're not preventing, we are not treating disease with Nopalea. And I think that's an important uh, part that we put in here uh, right now so that our viewers understand we're not curing and treating disease. Okay, and here's what National Institute of Health says. It says chronic inflammation is not a specific disease, it's a mechanistic process. And Dr. Conrad, I think you are explaining the process of the body, then inflammation is a normal process of the body. Okay. And it's important for our viewers to know that uh, we're, not, we're not treating disease with Nopalea, that's not it. What it's doing is addressing inflammation. And that leads to pain, which is what I was feeling with the inflammation and the cortisone, you know, for a while, but the inflammation was still there. So when you try to explain medically, why did suddenly James Robinson, and one of the biggest problems you had, you knew I wasn't going to work out in the gym, okay? I think a treadmill is where you hang your trousers, all right? Yeah. That's not, but you knew I needed to keep moving, and you could see with golf I did, because there's yeah. so much involved, and I'm a very flexible 76-year-old guy, and you, you'll tell the world that, okay? It's kind of miraculous. You probably thought, man, you know, but see, I couldn't do some things until I got better and stayed with it. Here's what I want to know. I, I got to know this. If it treats the inflammation, if it treats it in this area where I'm, I'm, I want you, I want everybody to have it. I can't say anybody get to the level I was, but there's a possibility, but you'll get better. Does it also perhaps treat the inflammation in other parts of your body to calm that inflammation? Is that possible that it would slow the inflammation if that's what's in the product, in the plant God gave us? The answer to your question is yes. And let me, uh, let me explain that a little bit because I think you made an important point. The, the, there are many things that cause inflammation inside our body. Inflammation, in some instances, like your elbow, stimulates a nerve and it's like, James, pay attention to me, do something, help me, I'm, I need support. And, and just like with the people we talked about in the trials that had the upper neck and back pain, they, their body was inflamed and it was asking for help and people took this and it decreased the inflammation and allowed them to do more, be more active and actually take more responsibility, which Betty's a big theme of yours, I know, to, to live a better, longer life. So we're not treating a disease or anything, we're actually helping the body operate more appropriately and effectively. So. The answer to your question is that wherever there's inflammation, the bioflavonoids, the, this is really a food, as you were talking about. And it's it, just like when you eat certain fats, it does bad things to the body, and other fats does miraculous things to the body. What 
I believe Michael has found here is a specific substance made by a plant that is going to help the body operate more effectively and help people live a longer, more vital life. And that's what it did to you in your your elbow. And I will tell you, I checked the high sensitivity, high sensitivity C-reactive protein in both of you. I've been doing it since Dr. Ricker taught me that, you know, 10 years ago. And, and there were times when yours was high and I was worried about you. The last four or five years have been checking it. It has been low <laughs> consistently. So I can't tell you that it's Nopalea that's doing that 100%, but what I can tell you with a similar lifestyle, with a similar diet, with a, actually a slightly less active lifestyle, your HSCRP was elevated. I was really worried about it. Now it's back down. It's normal. You're and always happy to see me. You <laughs> got right. good reports. Well, you know, you're 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 a, a well-known person that I can point to and say this is this is. I but I'm also a challenge. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Well, that's why I have Betty. <laughs> well, <laughs> Thank can goodness. I say because you mentioned responsibility, <laughs> yeah. I do have that real strong in my heart. And as a person that is over 75 years old, my heart really goes toward our generation and those a little bit younger and a little bit older. I feel like we don't have to. Sometimes as, at our age, we kind of think, oh, well, I deserve to feel like this. I'm so tired. I don't feel like it. So we just sit in our chair and we don't get out and move around and, exercise, and we continue to feel worse. I, I, I don't accept that. No. I want to be active. I want to feel good until I'm a Christian. So I want to feel good until God calls me home. And he just says, come, daughter, I'm ready to see you. Yep. And I just, I, I feel like that's so important. I don't like to live on a lot of medication. You know, you just have, if something comes up and I have to take something, you have to nearly force me to. I have to really explain <laughs> it to you make sure you understand But I it. really do think it's important that we take responsibility for our own bodies that God gave us. We're, these are vessels that, that God expects us to take care of. Yeah. And as much as possible, Michael, I just feel like yes. it's important. And why not if I hear about something that I believe that's going to make me feel better, even though I don't have a specific ache or pain or something, anything to add to my well, welfare and my well-being, I want to I wanna take it and be a part of it. Yeah. And Michael, I know that's a, another theme with Trivita that I've always resonated with and believed in. You're not saying, here's a magic pill, take it and you'll be fine. You're saying you have to be active. You have to take personal, a uh, personal role in it, but let's give you everything you can to really nurture the body, build the body up and have you live well. And it's not about disease. Uh, you and I have had this conversation for years. People start to talk about themselves like, I'm a diabetic, like they are a disease, or I'm a hypertensive, like they are, that's who they are. That's not who you are. I absolutely rebuke that. You're a God-given person that has a tremendous a, a purpose. There's no one like you that's ever lived, no one like you that ever will live, and you have a purpose in life. Get up and go do it. Now, if you're feeling uncomfortable, let's go explore it, let's figure it out, let's get that out of your way. And that's what Trivita has always been about, and that's what Nopalia is helping people, thousands of people do. It's not treating disease, it's keeping people well and healthy and vital and decreasing the inflammation in their body because it's a food that you discovered that is incredibly effective and been proven by double-blind, randomized, placebo-controlled trials, which is very important so that people don't, in the United States, don't get misled by it. And you've made it available. And, and I want to thank you. And it's easy to take. I take it twice a day myself. I'm very faithful. Because actually one time we didn't get it sent up. We didn't order sent up for the return. And in about three or four days, I could feel aches coming back that I had not felt. My question to you, if it addresses inflammation like in this joint, would it also perhaps help with inflammation that's causing some of the other problems, cardiovascular? Is it possible that it would lessen inflammation and be a, a contributing factor? Because you're saying in our tests, you've been amazed that the things you were concerned about are not there. I'm not taking a bunch of drugs to make that go away. I'm not addressing them with some serious flow. Something's going on. Is it possible that this actually helps inflammation in other areas. Well, we know it is because of the study that was done. There was a, a very expensive, very well done study that literally showed that the inflammation, the kind of inflammation that Harvard's identified in that study is associated with having more heart attacks and strokes. At the beginning, they gave people a fluid. They didn't know what it was. Some of the people got the nopalea. Some of the people didn't. They followed it over time. And the people who started off with high levels of inflammation in their body, they got nopalea. It came down. 
the people who didn't get no play, but they got the placebo, they did not have nearly as beneficial a response. So it, the answer to your question is definitively yes. Does that mean it's going to stop heart attacks and strokes and things like that? That's not what we're claiming here. No. But what we are saying is there's a blood test that has been associated with increased heart attack, strokes, and other problems, and that the blood test when you take Nopalia gets lower, and does that mean you're not going to have a heart attack stroke? As you said, Betty, when God calls you, you're yeah. gonna go. Yeah. And, and, and that's maybe you have a heart attack or stroke, but what I've seen in you, and you've been wonderful about this, James, I mean, you are a real model to the people watching this show, is that you ate healthier fats. You ate less fat in your meat. You ate more vegetables. You started taking Nopalea, and as a result of that, I, can, I can't keep up with you these days, and I'm 20 years wanna, younger than you are. I want to thank you. And, and Michael, you, you said Harvard will you know, send you this for $18. You said you'll send it to people who want to know, are you, are you offering people the opportunity to get Nopalea now, some special offer? Uh, yes, we have a great offer as far as related to introducing Nopalea, and uh, that will be included, the Harvard report along with it, and also a food guide. Because as you say, Dr. Conard, it's not about taking, you know, so many times we look for the one magic whatever. This is not about magic. This is not about one thing. This is about having the information that we need, and that's why understanding inflammation is so important as far as in what Harvard has documented, and it's something that we want people to understand and know so that they can address their whole life. Because even today, we know that you can inflame yourself physically in the way that you think. If you're full of anxiety, if you're full of anger, if you're full of all kinds of negative emotions, that also is a inflammatory okay, environment that will manifest itself physically. So when we talk about Trivita, we talk about the 10 essentials. We talk about the way we eat, the way we think, the way we move. And uh, one thing that I believe that people will experience if they will commit to an anti-inflammatory lifestyle, and that is spiritually, that is mentally, that is physically, their quality of life is going to go up. You're going to feel better. <laughs> You're going to move better and you're going to be better because internally you are going to be better as you bring inflammation down. So yes, it's a, a, a very wonderful offer that we are giving to uh, our viewers today. And what Dr. Conard said he wanted for us is uh, add years to our life and life to our years. And I believe this will do it. This is a terrific offer. I, I would just like to suggest that you make a commitment to say, you know, it's not gonna be like a test. It's gonna be like a change. And I'm gonna put this into a practice in my life. It's obviously nutritional. It has benefits, and I'm gonna be faithful to it. I really do hope you'll take advantage of this opportunity. I think you'll be the recipient of many blessings and benefits that you can experience and share with others. Thanks so much for watching. The preceding was a paid program brought to you by Trivita.